How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. So today we are doing some tournament bass fishing. We're fishing our local tournament again and hopefully guys we can get past second place because we have got second place a few times and I'm about sick and tired of being sick and tired of getting second place. So we're going for first tonight as always and uh, I actually brought more rods today than I usually do. We're actually taking uh, my buddy's boat. My boat, I'm having trouble with my, my battery. Man, I cannot get that thing going just right. Seems like it, there's always something little that's wrong. Those old boats, I'm telling you, you're gonna spend a ton of money if you're not careful. It is like 80 something degree out here. I don't know how good the bite's gonna be, but uh, we got a little bit of everything tied on right now, so I think that surely, surely to goodness, we can find something that they'll eat. And guys, for the first time this year, I believe it's the first time this year, I have a 10 inch worm tied on. Good old green pumpkin 10 inch Bass Pro Shops worm. And I'm going to be tossing that thing around today, and I think that should be able to catch some big ones. Throwing big baits like that will eliminate some of those smaller fish that we tend to catch out here. Sometimes, I don't know. You'll be surprised. Those, those little bitty fish sometimes will swallow a big honking bait, and I ain't kidding about that. Get on out here to meet Jason. I'm running a little bit behind today. Had a bunch of different stuff going on. Didn't even get rigged up till like 10 minutes ago. So, All right, guys, let's get on out to the ramp. Guys, I'm inserting this into the beginning of the video, but I forgot to do this week's subscriber catches. They are, these are our subscriber catches of the week. If you guys want to see your picture on the channel, email me at baitwithtate at gmail.com or DM me on Instagram at fishingwithtate, and I'll try to get your pictures up here. So, yeah. We pulled over in the shade for a few minutes. We still got like 20 minutes till the tournament starts. So, uh, what you got tied on? You got a frog. I got a Ned, a curly tail worm, a shaky head, and a whopper plopper. Just a little bit of everything. That's pretty much what I've done too. Man, I'm blowed out right there. That's pretty much what I got on too. Just a little bit of everything. I brought a couple spinning rods and some just dragging stuff and then a couple moving baits. But, I don't know, surely to God, we got something that'll catch a big one tonight. Maybe hook into a few keepers, bring out the dub on the tournament, bring home some money, make a good video. Just a win-win for everybody. About 15, 20 minutes to blast off, so we're just gonna hang out and chill. See you guys at spot number one. Third come off. Oh, it broke my hook. Look at that. Broke it. Well, guys, the bite is off. We're sucking it up. We've thrown everything, finesse. Power fishing, swim baits, big worms, tiny worms, medium sized worms, Frogs. anything that you could possibly throw, frogs, just whatever. And they we've not I've not even got a nibble. Jason's got a few bites. So we're gonna change locations, maybe try a different pattern out, maybe go try out some docks, which we fished some docks, but they was pretty shallow. Yeah, we're gonna go try something different, see if we can catch some fish, but we got a long time left. Got one. Good? Uh -oh. Oh, I don't want to dig it. Make it no. No. Hey, buddy. You chill out, I'll get you out of that thing. Oh my lord. In the mouth. I hooked him in the mouth with a green sunfish. That's what's eating me up. Look at that. Boots. I don't know what that is. I don't know my pan fish that well. 
I just bit that fluke. Uh, yeah, he might be a keeper. He's pretty good. Uh, he's not big, but he's probably a keeper. Think so? Uh, maybe not. No. Man. Why? Why was he fighting so hard? You seen it? I mean, you seen him. He wasn't pulling drag or nothing. My drag set. It's like, man, that's, that's a good fish. Cool dink. Yeah, he, he took a he took a dive there. I thought he was good for a minute. Guys, that was on the little Ned Zone. It's a little Ned rig bait from X Zone Lures. Pretty good looking little bait. It's my first time trying it. I actually got these a while back. It's been a while since I've had them. I haven't got to really try them. But looks pretty good. Another one. Another one just fighting like like something wild. Never seen the beat in my life. Look how deep he took it. He ate it, didn't he? Yeah. Well. Chill out, my guy. There you go. Yeah, he took it good. There you go. He's in good shape. Bunch of dinks today. This might be a keeper. Looks like. It's a what? Looks like a good one. Oh. Bigger. Ah, he's gonna be close. Come off. I don't think he was. Could have been. How are we here? Well, guys, it's a few hours. What? Maybe an hour, hour and a half later. And uh, talking to somebody up here. But uh, we've still caught just some tiny like fish, like four or five, something like that. Damn. But uh, just not really getting much size. Had one on that may have been a keeper. I don't know for sure. So I don't know. We're just going to try to throw some. I'm going to try to throw a little bit bigger baits yeah. and see if we can get a bigger bite here toward the end of the day. Hey, so y'all stay tuned. See what we can do here. He's still fresh. Tiny one. Again. Better than I've caught. Caught on this little bait. I got to have a mystery tackle box. I don't even know what it's called. Different though. Armless lizard. Armless lizard. I amputated. I amputee lizard. So guys, it is the next day. Thanks so much for watching up to this point. Did not catch any big fish. I really contemplated about posting this video, thought about posting something different. But unfortunately, that is about all the fishing that we got to do. Because if I had my phone, I would show you, but we've got rain in the forecast for the next seven days. So I figured I'd put it out there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That's just real life sometimes. I just catch small fish sometimes. You know, it is what it is. 
So you can't go out and whack big ones every day. If you did, then it wouldn't be as you know be as rewarding. So, but yeah, guys, if uh, if you're not already following me on TikTok, go check me out over there. Um, I'm been going live. Actually, well, I went live once. I'm gonna go live again. And also go check me out on Instagram. And of course, if you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit that little subscribe button. Turn it gray. Hit the little like button on the video. And also drop me a comment. Let me know what you're feeling. So I don't know if I'll get to go fishing this week. I hope I do. And if I get opportunity, I am going to go. It's actually getting ready to start raining right now as we speak. I was getting ready to try it right now because the forecast was showing that maybe it's going to let up just a little bit and maybe not rain later on today. But guys, again, I post every Sunday, every Thursday. If any of you guys want your picture on the channel, make sure to email me at baitwithtate at gmail.com or DM me on Instagram at fishingwithtate. As you can see, it's starting to rain, so I got to get inside. So I'll see you next time on another episode of Fishing With Tate.